CTV News has learned a small plane was involved in a collision at YVR on the weekend. The aircraft struck a barrier just before takeoff. Sinjin Alexander now on what steps are being taken to make sure it doesn't happen again. That is a Beechcraft 350, a twin turboprop, surrounded by emergency vehicles not long after crash fire rescue was enacted. At 4.45 Saturday morning at Vancouver International Airport, the plane run by Alcan Air was making its way to the runway for takeoff when the pilots made a wrong turn. The aircraft hit a barricade on a portion of the airfield that was recently shut down for repairs. The construction is new. The construction that's taking place right now has only been in place for about a week. So that could have led to some confusion for the pilot. CTV News has learned proper instructions were given from the control tower. Even so, Vancouver International is known for having a complex airfield. And as procedure dictates, an investigation will be launched. Why did the pilots make the wrong turn? How did they miss the barricade? Was proper lighting in place? What were staffing levels like at that time? It was before 5 o'clock in the morning. It's dark. It's new construction. Um, they're departing from a non-standard runway. Usually they depart the south runway. The airport says the plane collided with a barrier that was lit and that its worksite is compliant with Transport Canada standards. Notification of this closure was communicated by YVR to pilots on July 21st. The plane is often used as a medevac, but it's not clear whether anyone but the pilots were aboard. CTV News has reached out to the airline and are waiting for comment. The props and landing gear were damaged in the collision, but thankfully no other planes were involved and nobody was hurt. Sinjin Alexander, CTV News, Vancouver.